great three-day weekend slash Valentine's Day and um, that you're all gonna have a great shortened week. Um, I wanted to come on camera really quick and show my latest protective style. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is a wig. <laughs> I feel so ridiculous recording this video, but I decided to try out my first wig. I've had half wigs in the past that I've tried when I was transitioning, but this wig I bought with my own money. That's first. Did not. I was not sent this wig. This is a wig that I bought with my own money. There was a sale, um, but I wanted to invest in something good. So I have bought this April lace wig with a silk top. And um, I got this wig about a week maybe a week and a half ago, came in this little bag here, and uh, here's the box. I got myself, this is the Indian Remy 16 inch um, Italian Yaki hair. It's a glueless, full lace silk top, and the cap size is small. I always thought I had a really big head, but I went on their website and measured my head according to their measurements for cap sizes and my head was actually a little bit smaller than the small cap size recommendations. <laughs> so I actually had to tighten one of the straps in the back, it's got adjustable straps, so I had to t tighten it one little notch for it to feel really secure. And uh, yeah, I <laughs> apparently I have a small head. But I decided I was gonna, you know, wear a wig for a protective style. I love my crochet braids, but I can't cornrow tight. Like I'm still practicing, and tight cornrows work better for for crochet braids because otherwise the hair they get really loose and you have to take it out in like two weeks. From my last video, which I will link below, the crochet braids I tried in December, it was great. It was great style, but. I braided it myself and I don't know how to braid very tight so it didn't last very long. But thank you all for watching that video and saying it looked nice even though I wasn't a huge fan. But I am a huge fan of this wig. Like wow. Let me just turn around. Now I didn't want to go all out and get like a 20 inch wig which is what I've seen on YouTube a lot of people were doing the 20 inches but one girlfriend could not afford that sorry I did not buy the 20 inches because girl for your girlfriend cannot afford a 20 inch wig like this nearly broke the bank just saying if you guys are curious you know it was on sale 40% off, but it was still, you know, a lot of money with the shipping and handling and everything. But I love that it's almost, that it, most people think that it's my hair. And that was part of the reason why I got only 16 inches as well. Not just that I couldn't afford 20, but I wanted to get something that kind of looked like my own hair. And like, these are my edges, but I, I wanted it to look like my own hair kind of thing. Not to just like fool people, but not to like, have people asking, oh my gosh, is that your real hair? Because apparently people think that they can ask that at work and in large groups of people. I don't know, it's really embarrassing to me for people to ask and then I feel really bad lying because I don't want to lie, but I also don't want to tell a group of people, oh yeah, I'm totally not wearing, this is totally fake hair. Like, no, this is human hair um, and it's very light and fluffy. It looks almost identical to when I blow dry my hair and I'm going to insert a Instagram picture that I think looks a lot like this hair. You know, this hair is styled, you know, I curled it. It doesn't, doesn't come like this. Uh, and from the footage you saw of me taking it out of the box, you know, that it was just straight. But it looks like my blow-dried natural hair, which I thought was really cool. And I don't know, I like to change it up, kind of. And I want to wear straight hair a little bit more but I'm really afraid of heat damage, so I don't actually want to straighten my own hair, so I figured I'd get a wig, and I could play around with that. I'm still gonna take care of it and not like fry the crap out of it because this is an investment and I want to take good care of it. But 
and I really like it because of the silk top and I mean this hair looks a lot like my hair blow dried my edges are out so that's what this is but I love that it looks like it could be growing out of my scalp not only is the texture really natural but the silk top hides the knots and it's so cool and I love that um, it's a really good density. I don't remember the density that I ordered. I want to say it's like 120%. And I measured it and it actually is 16 inches you know, all around. And uh, yeah, it's a really cool wig and I'm hoping to like wear it more often. Like I'm gonna wear it for about a week or so. If you guys want to know how I got the very front of it to lay like really close to my scalp and look almost undetectable, then I will put a link below to a video that I found that was really helpful. I did almost exactly what she did and the products that I used are exactly what she used in that video. So I will leave a link to that, um, to her video in the description box. And all the details of this hair will be in the description box. If you guys have any questions, let me know. But I'm excited to have this really pretty, nearly natural looking uh, protective style. And I'm pretty sure, um, you'll see this wig a lot. So <laughs> let me know what you guys think. Uh, what are you doing to protect your hair? You know, I'm on this grow out challenge for my hair. I wanna get my hair to 20 inches at its longest point by December. So I'm doing protective styles. I've been taking hair vitamins and doing sort of regular <laughs> scalp massages. But yeah, really excited about this hair and this, this unit is just giving me life and I love it. But Hopefully one day my hair will be like this. I like this hair. Let me know what you guys think. Again, I bought this wig with my own money, so I don't have a coupon code or anything like that. Um, I just wanted to try it out for myself. And I must say I'm glad I took the plunge because this is awesome. Leave a comment below, like this video, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.